Look at your- Who's the real monster? Look what he did to us. What? What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Just Jazzy, and welcome back to my channel. Today, we're going to be playing some more Detroit Become Human. Okay. And as you know, same thing every time. This is going to be, what, part four? Um, if you haven't seen the previous three parts, I'll put a link in the bio for the playlist. Uh, make sure you hit that subscribe, like, notification button bell. Go ahead and leave a little comment. Leave me a little funny comment. Say something sweet. Say something cute. Say something funny. Say anything. I really don't give a fuck. Okay. Let's just get straight into this gameplay. Let's fucking go. Don't hit him with the little car? Plastic with you? Hey, hey. How you doing, man? Let's go. Hey, listen, I got a shit hot tip for you. Number five in the third. Lickety split. Connor so fine, bro. This bay daddy right here. This bay daddy. You wanna flood it? That shit hot tip you gave me sent me back a week's wages. Come on, this is different. It's a hundred percent guaranteed. You can't go wrong. <laughs> we just start scanning this environment, bro. Food hygiene license. You can scan him. Gambling and fraud. Resisting a res breach of hygiene regulations. Bro, you are the cook. How how are you? Oh. <laughs> Alright, I'm in. Damn straight. Huh? Hey, won't regret this. <laughs> what is your problem? Don't you ever do as you're told? You don't have to follow me around like a poodle. I'm sorry for my behavior back at the police station. I didn't mean to be unpleasant. Oh, wow. You've even got a brown nose and apology program. Guys at Cyber Life thought everything, huh? I'm just trying to be nice, bro. Here you go. Thanks, Gary. I'm starving. Don't leave that thing here. Huh, not a chance. Follows me everywhere. And do. And what about it? Let's go. Hey. Hi. Turn around. Eat your burger, bro. Eat burger. Enjoy your meal. Thank you. I don't I don't want to talk about any of that. I don't. Just let him eat food in peace, bro. Let him eat food in peace. Do you eat here often? Most days. Gary makes the best burger in Detroit. Okay. Uh... Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Why do you hate Android so much? I have my reasons. Maybe I should tell you what we know about deviants. You read my mind. Proceed. Okay. We believe that a mutation occurs in the software of some androids, which can lead to them emulating a human emotion. In English, please. They don't really feel emotions. They just get overwhelmed by irrational instructions. Which can lead to unpredictable behavior. Emotions always screw everything up. 
The androids aren't as different from us as we thought. Whoa! Are we getting him to understand? Is there anything you'd like to know about me? Hell no. Well, yeah. Um, why do they make you look so goofy and give you that weird voice? Okay. Cyberlife androids are designed to work harmoniously with humans. Both my appearance and voice were specifically designed to facilitate my integration. Bro, gonna say we look goofy. Well, they fucked up. Okay. Don't do bay like that. Deviants before? Don't do bay like that. I forgot about home. A few months back, a deviant was threatening to jump off the roof with the little girl. I managed to save her. So I guess you've done all your homework, right? Yeah. Know everything there is to know about me? No. I know you graduated top of your class. You made a name for yourself in several cases and became the youngest lieutenant in Detroit. Yeah, bitch, I know you. I also know you've received several disciplinary warnings in recent years. Whoa! You spend a lot of time in bars. You don't have to get on him like that. So what's your conclusion? You cool. I think working with an officer with personal issues is an added challenge. But adapting to human unpredictability is one of my features. He winked at him. I just got a report of a suspected deviant. It's a few blocks away. We should go have a look. I'll let you finish your meal. I'll be in the car if you need me. Okay. It better be good, bro. It better be delicious. Hey, Connor. Hey. You run out of batteries or what? I'm sorry. I was making a report to Cyberlife. Uh. Well, do you plan on staying in the elevator? Let's no. Let's go, bro. I'm coming. <laughs> no. No. I'm not staying in here, no. Hey, what do we know about this guy? Not much. Just that a neighbor reported that he heard strange noises coming from this floor. Nobody's supposed to be living here. But the neighbor said he saw a man hiding an LED under his cap. Oh, Christ. If we have to investigate every time somebody hears a strange noise, we're going to need more cops. Go in, bro. Knock again. Hit that Anybody police home? bang. That go, go, go. Open up, Detroit police. We call that the nigga knock where I'm from. Nigga knock, Stay nigga behind knock. Me. Got it. Whoa. Hold on. Ugh. Why they suck the this shit was banging, boy? Alright, go. Let's go. Come on. Don't be shy. Pigeon. Pigeon? Ugh. Jesus, this place stinks. Pigeon. Uh, like we came for nothing. It's pigeon Our man's everywhere, gone. bro. Pigeon everywhere. I like pigeons. RT. Probably initials. He put his initials in his jacket? That's something your mom does when you're in first grade. Don't be mean, bro. What else? What else? Take a looky look. Take a looky look. Traffic. The driver's license is fake. Cool. At least we didn't come for nothing. White pigeon out the way. He said, move, bitch. Check fridge, check fridge. Check, open. Uh. Oh, 
boy doesn't eat, bro. He's he's android. Okay, let's go in here. Right? Yep, let's go. What's going on in here? What's going on in here? What you got going on? Take a look. I didn't even see that. I literally didn't even see it's that. It's LED is in the sink. Not surprised it was an android. No human could live with all these fucking pigeons. It's these same symbols, bro. Same symbols. Any idea what it means? No. RA9. Written 2,471 times. How do you know that? It's the same sign Ortiz's android wrote on the shower wall. Facts. Why are they obsessed with this sign? I don't know, baby. Figure it out. Looks like mazes or something. Obsessive compulsive writing. Homeboy's probably up there. was the last guy in Detroit to keep some. Alright. Electronic books, you can't smell. Why would you nigga want to smell paper? Actually, no, let me not, because I like the way books smell. I love me a stinky ass book. Hold on. Towards entrance. Homeboy heard us. He's still here. See the pages turned yet. Uh. Whoa! God damn the fucking pigeons! What are you waiting for? Chase it! Get him, bro! Get him! Take risks, bro. Balanced. Oh, my God. Direct but crowded. Go, bro. Go. Catch, homie. Oh my god. Oh, I didn't see it. Where did he go? Oh my god. Oh, you fucking biatch. Where do I go? This way. Oh my god, I wasted time. Turn around. What? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god.
I didn't mean to be, bro. Just go. Watch out, bro. Watch out. Where did he go? What? should have been faster you'd have caught it if it weren't for me ah uh. that's all right i didn't want homie to die we know what it looks like i didn't want homie we'll to fight. die i did not want to <laughs> bro hey connor what bro nothing huh he said Bro is a dog. He tilted his head. He said. Y'all kind of looking like a cold. What's going on? Who are you? Fugitives. Just like you. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. North. This is Jericho? It's a refuge for those who don't want to be slaves anymore. Okay. I don't understand. I thought Jericho was a place where androids lived in freedom. We do live in freedom. It may not be what you hoped for, but here we have no master. We okay. don't belong to anybody. Okay. How many are you? There are 19 of us still in working order. The rest were damaged escaping their masters. Oh. Many tried to reach Jericho. Few succeed. Humans have little pity for our kind. I understand how you feel, but we have more freedom here than you ever did. Okay. Waiting in the dark for something to happen? That's not how I see freedom. You're lost. Just like the rest of us. We didn't ask for this. All we can do now Let's deal with it. Your eyes are scary, sir. You're safe here. Okay. You can stay with us as long as you want. All right. Sure. Go and see Lucy. Who the f she might be able to help you. Don't you flirtatiously talk to me, ma'am. Fucking succubus. She won't me, bro. She won't me. Settle in. Let's take a looky look around. There's a lot of things to explore. Let's go take a looky look. Who is singing like this? Why is there blood on the... I've heard humans are afraid of dying too. Do you know what happens after death? Ah! Uh. No. No, I don't. Well, I'm about to find out. Oh, I mean, she kinda... She kinda... She kinda... What's your name? Marcus. Just die? Did you just die holding my hand? Girl, you You look scary, girl. Okay. Is that an arm? Uh, okay. What's going down over here? this brother they threw him out when they didn't want him anymore he was living on the streets before we brought him here 
They'll all shut down if we don't find a way to help them. To help them, we need blue blood and bio components. We salvage what we can from those who shut down. But there's never enough. So, how do they survive? They won't. We're slowly dying out. So why would you continue to stay back here, dummy? Let's take a looky look elsewhere. What's this? No more legs, bro. No more legs. What if we can be homie that goes to grab parts because we know where Junkyard is? Huh? This the warehouse that docks. Homeboy, homeboy is a GPS. Like, if you don't go somewhere, start fire. Who banging? Maybe this ain't blue men. Actually, we could we could be the blue men, low key, because we all got the blue blood, and we could just get our drums and boom, 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 boom. tribal. What was your function before coming here? What do you care? Girl! Don't be fucking rude. Stupid ass bitch. A lot of these guys in pretty bad shape. That's how the humans treat those who disobey. They despise us. They'll never accept what we are. Girl. Who found this place? Nobody knows anymore. Whoever he was, his body's probably laying somewhere on this boat. If you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place. I didn't come here. Girl! I'm just trying to make conversation. I don't need to... What's all the singing I'm hearing? Hold on. Are you Lucy? She look kind of cool. Sit down. Okay. I'll sit. Shit. I'll sit. Be. She kind of. She kind of. Show me. Okay. Pull them things out. Pull them things out. Pull them things out. Bro. I'll stop the bleeding. Okay, baby. I'll let you do whatever you want to do. Drink this. Okay. Thank it. Chug that ish. Ugh, that nasty ASMR. He said. You look so confused. Give me your hand. Okay. She kind of she kind of bad. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> you had it all and you lost it all. You've seen hell and now hell lives in you. Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail. 
Your choices will shape our destiny. Girl, you getting too close. Making me feel all hot and bothered. Mm. She kinda Ooh. sing for me, girl. Please. Alright, I'll leave you alone. Oh, sorry. Look at him. Simon. Bro was in I sleep know mode. Can find spare parts. Cyber Life Warehouse is in Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. Facts. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. You don't need we to. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. Facts. Maybe it's worth a try. Let's go. I'm in. Good. Let's go. Yeah. 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 You gonna be okay? We'll get some help here. Yeah. Soon this will all be just a bad memory. Yeah. I love you, girl. I love you. This is the place. That loud ass game. Let's go, baby. Let's go. It's cold, ain't it? I know she go. Girl, you all wet and shit. Let's give door a big knock. Ring doorbell. Long ass ring. She held that shit. She said, bitch, you finna. Are you his lock coat? Who's asking? I was told you could help us. I don't know who told you that. You came to the wrong place. I'm sorry. Wait. We really need your help. Yeah. Look at his bushy ass brows. Come in. Okay. Be shy. Luther, would you be so kind as to take these ladies' coats? Oh, don't be afraid of my big friend here. Luther is just another android that I helped. He keeps me company in this big, empty old house. Please. Okay. Make yourselves at home. Wait, the blick is in the coat, isn't it? Wait, isn't the blick in the coat? And he just took it. How did you hear about me? An android. On the street, he said you could help us. I see. Devian, huh? Huh? What about her? She's human. And? You want to find a safe place. Yeah. Somewhere where you can start a new life. I hear Canada is very lovely at this time of year. Beautiful landscapes, open spaces, clean air, and no android laws. Great place for a fresh start. 
Yes, that's... That's exactly what we want. Of course. Why does he have all that blood on him? Well, I can help you. He has a lot of but blue blood. He has a lot of tracker? blue blood yeah. on his... All androids are fitted with a tracking device to locate them at all times. I'll remove yours, and then you'll both be safe. No. Come on. No. Follow me? Nah, he has a lot of blue blood on his outfit. No. Uh-uh. 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 Uh, the little one can wait for us in the living room. No. No. She always stays with me. What are you doing? Of course. Right this way? Everything we need is in the basement. No. I need to take a look around first, bro, because you got too much... He has too much ush and gush on the floor, too much blue blood on fit. Oh no. I'm still like, um, let's go, I guess. I feel like it's it's going to be I don't like this place. I know, girl. I don't like I don't like it Let's either. Let's go. I have a bad feeling. I know. I don't trust him either. We have to be careful. Homie is blocking exit. Hold on, turn around. Are these prisons? Please excuse Hush up. It's the mess. I need it somewhere discreet for my machines. Removing trackers is illegal, so I opted for discretion over comfort. I hope the little one isn't too scared. No. No, she'll be all right. That's good. Come on, Alice. What's in there, girl? What'd you see? What is that? Nah, 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 nah. What this is way, that? Please. What is that? She. What is that, though? What you mean? I can't go? Okay. Oh, no. Check that out. Remember where my keys are just in case I gotta do a little quick time or something. I should warn you, this could be quite unpleasant. You know what's strange? For some unknown reason, the trackers seem to stop working in Deviance. That's why it's so hard to find them. <laughs> so, actually, there's no reason to remove your tracker. What? But you said that... Yeah, uh, people believe what they want. You Deviants are so naive. They all come to me expecting me to help them. And I just reset them. Reset them? them or I keep them for my little experiments. No! No! I don't want to be reset! Let me go! Ah! Oh, I forgot about the child. Um, lock it up. I'll deal with it later. Alice! Alice, no! Wow. A deviant that wants to be a mother. Bitch. That's that's so sweet. Watch him. I'm so deluded. I think it's time we put you out of your misery. Uh uh. what you get for having a dream. It always ends up the same way. To 
tears and disillusionment. Believe me, you're better off being raised and feeling nothing. No more pain. No more hopes dashed. Almost down to you. Kara! Huh? Ah. <laughs> oh, poor little Alice. Memory corruption. Oh, looks like mommy doesn't remember you at all, huh? Looks like mommy's completely forgotten you. I did yeah, not forget her, bro. Oh, all right, that's enough. Come on. Bite his ass. <coughs> Whoa! You bit me. I'm gonna teach you some manners, you little bitch. Kara! Wake up, Kara! Meet me in the living room. Meet you in the living room? Bro, if you don't get me out of this... Machinery? Find a way to escape. Hold on, Q. Pause a short circuit. Shift. Grab her and go. Oh my God. Let's go. Okay, we need to find her. Q? She's not in there. It's in here, look. Help us. <laughs> Oh, we got homies. We got homies. No, this can't be happening. We need to get the blick, bro. He likes to play with us. What? Creating monsters. What? For his amusement. What? Look at your. Who's the real monster? Look what he did to us. What? Go. Oh my God. We need we need some kind of some kind of something. Cause there's no way I'm about to go in this bitch with nothing on. Okay, the blick is in a jacket though. The blick is in a jacket. Luther! Luther! Yes, Laco. I should be done here in 10 minutes or so. Have a look at the little one, see what I can do with it. Understood, Laco. I'll bring you the little one in 10 minutes. 10 minutes? We're here. Fine, fine, fine. Bro. I need, I need something, bro, like. Oh my fuck. Oh my fuck. There's something over here. 
Can I get pool stick? No, keep going. She's still inside. Okay, so I have to find her. But I know I can go out that way. Turn around, let's go. There's no weapon in here. There's nothing I can use. I can't use an ostrich. I have eight minutes to get this fucking girl, bro. Oh. Find her. Hello? What? I can open the cage. I'm not doing that. We're freeing all the niggas. We're freeing all the niggas. We're freeing all the niggas. We freeing all the homies. What are you doing here? Has the master authorized you to be here? Hush! You must always obey the master. Oh yes. What are you doing? You're not gonna hurt me. No. No. No, you wouldn't do that. No. No, of course not. Just go. What's in here? What's over here? Nothing? Let's go. No, something's gonna happen. Cory, you remember me? How could I forget you? Something's gonna happen. I'm so sorry. You were right. We never should have come here. We have to go. Follow me and don't make any noise, okay? Yeah. Hiding the only option. F. F. Not gone. What? The little one is gone. Well, I can't have just disappeared. It's gotta be here somewhere. What are you waiting for? I knew it, bro. Go. Ding. <laughs> Ah! 
Where the where the robot homies at? You should have listened to me. Where they at? Where they at? Where they at? What? What are you doing? Get out of my way. No. Not this time. What? I said get out of my way or I'll shoot right through you. Oh my god. Squat! Squat! Who let you out? Squat! Get away from me! Get away from me! Obey me! I'm your master! I'm your master! Ah! I'm hitting that. Look at him, bro. Just go be free, like. Luther! Oh my god! I didn't want to hurt you. I know, Daddy. He programmed me to obey him. I know. When I saw the little one risk her life to save you, it was like save opening my eyes end. for the first time. Finally, I could see. Let me stop. I know you have no reason to trust me after what I did. But I know someone who could help you across the border. His cut kind of fresh, though. I could take you there. Take me. I could please. protect you. Protect me. You and the little one. Protect me. Oh my god. All right. I trust you. <laughs> I was so scared of losing you. Oh my god. mommy and daddy bro all right you guys that was part four of the detroit become human if you haven't seen the previous three parts i'm gonna leave a link in the description with the playlist make sure you go and watch them so you can get some context for this crazy ass shit okay make sure you leave a like leave a comment subscribe hit me up on twitch at just jazzy if you want to keep up with the live gameplay of this beautiful fantastic amazing spectacular game okay and i'll see you next time in part bye, -bye.